Hello there and welcome back to another episode in Stranded Alien Dawn. So, in today's episode we are hopefully gonna get one of those mechs done. The first one that we are researching right now is the light mechs. And uh, yeah, 33% already, already there. What uh, happened since the last episode is we had Ken quickly construct as one of those mech cores, which meant we can now start researching the light ones. And once this one is done, we will hopefully get the combat mechs as well, which is a little bit more powerful, it seems. And uh, yeah, this year is almost done. So that is year two, and they are going to celebrate very soon. I was going to send a couple more people on some expeditions, but I think right now, yeah, let them celebrate the, the New Year's Eve. Cool. So other things that we are doing in the background. We are trying to create a bit more space around our housing estate here. It worked out until now, I'd say. It was nice and close, but um, I, I think we'd like to have a bit more room in our backyard over here so we could have some more power producers as well. I know in the previous one we talked about putting them uh, slightly further away, but I'm not entirely sure. If I'm completely honest, yeah, placing them and building them here is um, probably a good way to get them out of the way and having them in the producing us um, electricity in the background but every time they need repairs it's gonna be yeah a bit of a trek so anyways here we go everyone's celebrating Quinn seems to be sick but that's okay we'll just hide that oh wait a second so Ken's been scavenging and we got another mech core and eight electronics well that's pretty amazing let's uh no not this one let's bring this back have a look uh, oh yeah we do have two now Wonderful. So that means we can either construct a three, no, two light mechs, or just one and save it for the big one for later. I think, yeah, that's what we are probably going to do. Right, yeah, so with the expansion over here, we are going to have to sort of move some of these plants out of the way a little bit, which will be fine, I think. And, um, yeah, essentially, instead of four tiles wide, we're going eight now. And same over here. Let's have a look. One, two, three... Four. One, two, three, four. So somewhere here. Hold on a second. One, two, five of them. Oh dear. That's um five is a lot. Uh okay. Let's um let's try and take care of them real quick as well. We are gonna need Hmm. Once we aggro one, yeah, two is a bit too much, and we can't really hide anywhere here. Wish we had one of those mechs ready. How far are we? Oh no, only 55%, so... Oh no, that's gonna be difficult. Don't want them to attack us all at the same time. So let's have a look. Power seems to be good. Is anyone around? Okay, Ember. Oh, you're drafted already. Okay, we got two turrets on that side, two on this side. Three... And two. Okay, so this side might be a little bit better. Right, right, right. So why don't you come outside here? Ken is doing some boots and Quinn is researching. So let's leave you there. Lara, I, I think you're going to have to go turn this one on. And then after you're done... Oh, no, but you're constructing here as well. Why don't you turn this one on too? Just in case. Okay, so Ember with you. There's no way we're going to be able to run all the way back. I think they're just going to run through those fences here. Now, what could be... Hmm, we might use those trees as a cover. Actually, again, so... Can... Lara, what if you take a weapon? Do we have any weapons? Oh yeah, we got false rifle over here. Ooh, now might be perfect time for us. Perfect opportunity. Oh no, he's already running way too fast for us. Ember, keep going. Maybe one more hit. Okay, first one down, four more to go. Let's see, are we going to be able to... Maybe this one, that's going to be the next one. Alright, let's give it a try. Run. Ember, do not stop here. Just keep running, please. Oh, actually, one more shot. There we go. Where are you going? Come back here. Oh no, we aggroed accidentally three of them now. So I'm not sure we'll be able to run... Oh, I think we can. Where are you going? Okay, one's over here. Okay, lovely. Uh, Ken, why are you still... No, let's get into the into the trees. Are they all attacking now? Oh, yes, they are. Okay, fine. I think it is time to try and retreat 
back to where the turrets are. Oh no. Lara. Run there, please. Oh, yikes. Okay, Ember. Might want to have you climb up on this wall here. Maybe this one. And the rest of you, if you fall back just a little bit as well. And there we go. How many left? Only two of them. Where's the other big one? Is it somewhere here? No, it isn't. Now that's a hu huge purple mantis as well. Maybe he's knocked out somewhere. Not entirely sure. Oh, there it is. Okay. Unconscious. Bleeding out in 11, 11 hours. How many more? No, these turrets should be fine. I think you can take care of them pretty quickly and easily. Let's turn off the turrets on this side. So you're over here, maybe undraft these guys. Go and get healed. Oh no, he's awake again. Emeline, you might want to retreat. Oh, never mind. Everything's good, and we just have one more. Go and take care of that one as well, and I think everyone is sorted now. Yep, all five of them defeated. Wasn't that difficult at all. It was a little bit scary, I, I do admit that. And here we go, we finally have the light mechs research, so let's take a look. You are gonna take one of those mech cores, some metal alloys, and oh wow, that does look pretty, pretty amazing. Let's place you over here. And um, okay, walls are pretty much done, and I think we can also uh, start removing uh, these ones over here. Okay, yep, just wanna have a bit more space in here. Here we go. All of this can go. And the same with these ones. Lovely. Can we get this constructed quickly as well, Nova? You are having a bit of food. Okay, construct this one. Here we go. Bit of a priority. I would like this to be ready before the next wave hits. Uh, no research. Oh, never mind. Let's do the combat mechs right away as well. And uh, hopefully we can construct another one. Ken, what are you up to? Are you making a few clothes? Okay. Uh, we actually do need two of you. Power cells. Okay, we have enough electronics, CPU cores, power cells. Yeah, I think we'll be we'll be fine. And here we go. Our first small mech is now completed. I do like how it has like a little log here as well, the kill log. Last ten days, lifetime. Uh, so, description, here we go, a small mech with a big gun, a survivor with combat 3 is needed for its operation. Now I can't wait for another wave to hit us to give it a try and see, see how strong it is as well. I'm assuming it's, it's gonna be pretty powerful compared to our survivors. Whilst we are waiting for it, Quinn has actually already researched 31% into combat mechs. And right now we have only one mech core, but I'm hoping perhaps Ken, once he wakes up Perhaps we can we can try and make another mech core real quick because we do have enough resources. Oh yeah, CPU cores, tons of these ones as well, so so that's perfect. Okay, and here we go. Combat mechs are finally complete as well. Let's uh oh wow, that is massive. Let's place you over here. Who's the uh, our best construction survivor? That is Ember. Ember, what are you up to right now? Okay, you are playing darts, that is fine. Uh, Nova was building this, but I think, yeah, Ember's gonna go and do that instead. Since it is only 11 o'clock, I think we are gonna send out another expedition real quick. Okay, what do we have here? Fuel, we don't really need. Um, <laughs> this one, I think we do wanna send out to Nova. Maybe you can just go and explore a little bit. And Gwen, you can go on this one. I hope no one's gonna attack us whilst we are doing those expeditions. Okay, here it is. Our combat mech is also complete, which is quite amazing. We've got both of them ready for the next next wave. And uh, right, so this one seems like an open cockpit with a little gun or turret in front of it. Lights as well. Whereas the big one has... Oh yeah, it is enclosed. It seems like we have a bit of a missile missile launcher on one side and a pretty heavy cannon on the other one. Right, so a powerful mobile unit equipped with the missile launchers and machine guns. And the same thing, Combat 3 is needed to operate this bigger mech. And, well, you look at that, perfect timing. 
Where are you guys? Right next to us. Who is ready to go and cause some damage? Let's have a look. Activities. Whose combat is the highest? We, I think we can take Ken and Ember. Okay. Ember, you're going to go into this one. And Ken, why don't you go into the smaller one? Oh, wow. Okay, pretty massive range. Let's bring you out from the base as well. Oh, wow. Okay. Let's have a look. Grab you. You can leap as well. Okay, let's see what this means. Oh, okay. Pretty impressive. Order the mech to fire a barrage up to a desired location. How about... Oh, that's a little out of range, it seems. Ken, if you can walk a little bit forward as well. Lovely, let's give this a try real quick then. Um, <laughs> Alright, time to cook up some meat. Oh, I see. Wow. Now that is pretty impressive. Uh-oh. Okay, here we go. Get the tuna out of the way. Ken, where are you going? Now turn around and let's uh, clean this up real quick. Oh, wow. That is pretty impressive. It feels a bit overpowered, if I'm completely honest. I mean, just with the two of them, we're pretty much cleaned up most of the wave already. Are you guys still alive? Oh yeah, let's do it again. Maybe over there. Alright, onwards. Let's uh, clean up the rest of them. It seems only six of them are left. Let's try and leap with the big one as well. Oh, wow. Okay, pretty impressive, I'll be honest. I almost feel like we don't really need any other defensive buildings anymore. All we gotta do is send out those mechs and... I don't think we're gonna have any problems in the future. Here we go. This one's done as well. And the whole wave is complete. Okay, let's bring you guys back. Back to base over there. And that's it. That was um, super quick. Efficient. Pretty easy, I must say. And that that's it, yeah. Okay, Untraft and Dismount, same with you as well. Back to work, everyone. And that only took us, like, what? A couple of hours? And the whole wave was complete. I mean, yeah, this wave was a little bit easier. All we had was the small spike-tailed insects and one tune over here. A few uh, bloated overgrown insects as well, but I still feel like even if they were stronger and if there was more of them, we'd still be able to clear them pretty quickly with those two mechs that we have over here. I do hope we get some more powerful waves in the future as well to really test them out and see what their what their limits are. But I think for now we should be we should be able to expand our base pretty pretty confidently all we need is a couple of survivors to go out with the mix and and everyone else can pretty much chill at the house over here i guess when we get the dragonflies and maybe some tuners maybe it's a little bit more difficult yeah provided we have a few turrets around maybe in different locations i i think we'll be uh, we'll be able to protect our colony for the for the rest of the playthrough quite easily as well. Okay, we do have another music night. Yeah, let's let them celebrate the victory against the alien bugs. And I think for this episode, we can be pretty happy that we have uh, two of those mechs. We might do another one as well. Uh, right now, I don't feel it's necessary. Let's let them catch up with all the other tasks. I would like to have this whole uh, space cleaned up, tidied up, move those turrets over, add some different turrets as well, increase the power. Yeah, then we should be pretty good. And so far, I'll be honest, I wasn't quite sure if the defenses are going to be enough, but now that we do have the mix as well, I feel we don't need the fortifications. I mean, it would look much nicer. I don't think this playthrough is over just yet, because I'd, I'd still like to see what those force fields and the carbon fortifications are like as well, so we definitely try and improve this a little further. And yeah, I do want to improve our power situation as well, and hopefully find some more breakthroughs as well. What is happening here? Everyone is stressed out. Can't reach the power cells. Where are you guys going? Can't see what I'm doing. Okay. Handling furnaces. They're fine now. 
Okay, let's leave them at that. We'll let them uh, co continue with the construction projects over here. Hold on a second, distress signal. Yep, let's do it in the in the next one. Let's see if we can get another survivor, because that would be absolutely amazing. But for the time being, that's going to be it for this episode. So thank you so much for, for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you in the next one.